All right, so I'm going to start with this because I was eavesdropping and I overheard the conversation. You were in Colombia. I was. Yes. Tell me about that. Oh, man, it was amazing. So I went um, with now a great friend, but um, I met who is a producer, Lily Kligman, who um, I just did a film with called The Creatures with Fran Drescher. And um, I have a big fitness background and she has like a lot of fitness kind of connections and things she does down there. But we didn't know during filming, like production. Right. So we just had a release of the movie, we reconnected and it was like, oh, you know so-and-so, I know. So we did a whole fitness tour down in Colombia. We were teaching huge group classes with a company called Body Tech and um, Need My Rush and like spin classes and people. And everyone down there is all about the healthy lifestyle and just having fun and just such cool people. So we had such a great experience and they were so patient with me because I only speak like five words of Spanish. <laughs> and they're all versions of I need a coffee. <laughs> A Tinto Cafe. Yeah, that's Tinto. my. <laughs> that's what it is yeah, coffee. and so yeah. they don't know, like, or so Tinto had. Cafe. <laughs> um, it's great. And then yeah. we went also to this place that they had like the Bunsen burners and the tubes and all this yeah. stuff, and like they made the coffee fresh. Yeah. It was, they showed us the process straight from the bean. They burned it. They ground it. They put it through this thing. So did they you go to, Did you go to the farms? The coffee farms? Was it the co No, we didn't go to any oh, farms, okay, okay. but like uh, they gave us the whole tour of all yeah. the stuff. Nice. Like there was like thousands, like this bean came from this one right. and this one and it, it, it was just really it cool because I love like, coffee. Yeah. So it was Now, good. have you had coffee the same here since you've gotten back? Like I'm sure the experience is not the same now. No, <laughs> it's not. I mean, I, it sounds terrible, but I do like Star Wars. So I like, <laughs> but on the odd like cold brew, right, you know right, what I mean. Yeah, yeah. So they're the hot. They rain on the hot, hot coffee. Yeah, right. you what was your know favorite what I mean? dish? What was your favorite meal? Tell me what you had. Oh, favorite meal? Oh, Clara de Huevo. <laughs> Do you know <laughs> what that <laughs> is? Explain it to me. Tell me what this oh, is. Oh, it's egg dish. whites. It's, oh. <laughs> and I figured that out, yeah. and it was great. But it's not like the way that I make it. They made like this whole um, uh, at the place I was staying, like. It was like a 3D little like pancake yeah. of egg whites and it was delicious. Oh, you were still yeah, it was there. great. It, this, it's the simple things. <laughs> you were still healthy. You had to. I kept it healthy because we were doing a lot of minutes. Uh, I did like a cover magazine shoot too for oh, the thing. Okay. So it's called Revista Fit. So okay. that'll be coming out in October. Nice. Check it out. Nice. And um, so I wanted to keep it tight. Okay. You know what I mean? Well, I'm glad you loved it there. Tell yeah. me what else is going on with you. What's next? So coming up next is um, the final season of The Good Place. Nice. It's all coming together. Season four, it airs on September 26th on NBC. And um, yeah, bittersweet, very excited for it and so thankful, but also a little sad because right. it's coming to an end, right. you know? So, but all good things come to an end, right? right? So. And then something else pops up and you'll have... Yeah, things yeah. are coming down the chute. So um, uh, yeah, I'm ready for what's next as well. Now I have to ask you this last question, but we're here supporting the Chainsaw Artist and his sculptures are based off of the seven deadly mm. sins. Which ones do you relate to the most? <laughs> there's greed, there's envy, there's lust, I know. sloth, pride. So, <laughs> you, of, the one that I relate to the most, maybe not because of personal experience or things that I'm going through, but just because the the, the sculpture kind of I gravitated towards it was gluttony. Okay. And it just reminds me of like the 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 red oak, I believe it is, version of the David. Holding the pig mats, the, the intestines or the entrails kind of out and just the human anatomy, it's really kind of captivating in a weird yeah. way. Okay. So I, I like that one, gluttony. All right, well, that's what it is then. Thank you so much for speaking with Thank us. Thank you very yes, much. Have cool. a good one. Thank you.